Ooh. Ooh. I never play DB. Hey. Oh, who had the ball? My name is Keith Hill. I attend St. Augustine High School. I'm a class of 2026. Um, my goals for OT7 is just have a just have a successful game. Like all three games, we want to play good. Like get like one or two touchdowns. Make some like you know make my name known. Like make my name get out there. Right. You know have fun. Have fun with the guys. I really want to jump in that phone pit for real. You know. Facts. <laughs> Yeah, you know, see some people that I see on YouTube and stuff, you know, have one lifetime experience. Facts, man. Good answer. What do you think sets you apart from all other football players? What my makes mind. you unique? I feel like my mindset, like, I'm all, I always think ahead, like, I always think, like, oh, we're going to play this good team, or we're going to beat them. Like, I got to think good, like. Right, positive. Yeah, I always think positive and, like, humble. I'm a humble kid. Like, right. Yeah. All right. Well, saying that, man, um, what do you think going to be some of y'all biggest challenges, if any, y'all going to face this weekend? Uh, they've, been, they've been talking about, uh, what's the team? Low Pro? Low Pro? Low they've been pro? talking about Low Pro a lot. I don't really know the teams like that. But, you know, I just ball. Like, go out there. Okay. Just line it up. Right, what about the camaraderie? You know what I mean? It's got some players on the team that you never played with. Well, you think that's going to be like a problem getting to know, you know, other teammates? Or you think y'all going to just gel? It's football, like. Right. You no, know, because I know I, I know all of them. I play with all of them. Everybody's right. on my team I played with before. Right. So it's like I already got a bond with some, like all of them. Like today we was on the call just having fun. Right. We had our bond today. Like if I ain't know him, we know him today. Like we got made a bond today. Listen to music, playing games, like we made our bond today. Right. So like if I didn't know him, I know him now. That's a bet. So um who are some of your big influences in the sport and why? My favorite player in the field is like Tyreek Hill. Like he's so explosive, fast, he's small, hard to check. It's like yeah. That's like my favorite player. What do you think is the biggest contribution you can make this weekend to the team? Your biggest contribution? Mm. Uh, I don't really know. Probably get some like, get the like, constantly getting the first down for the team. You know, moving those chains. Yeah, moving the chains. Right. If I were to ask you to describe overtime, OT seven, overtime season in one word, what would that word be? Uh, exposure. Exposure, most definitely. What do you think give you guys the advantage on the field this weekend at OT seven? Uh. How we play, like, the boot, like, New Orleans and all the New Orleans kids, we play different from other states. Like, I feel like our talents is, like, rank one. Right. And like, we, like, look, we overlook. And like, right. Yeah. So I'm guessing with this question I'm about to ask you, um, do you think y'all going to win the whole thing? Because the question is, what do you think of your team chances of winning the whole thing this weekend? I got, I got confidence. We we. We gonna win, but it's like, nah, I got confidence we gonna win. Like, I don't get no doubt of losing. Like, I don't like losing, so I don't think about losing. Cause if I think about losing, then I just, I don't like that. I just always think about winning. Right, it been a long grind, man. Long grind, long seven on seven season. Um, How do you stay motivated throughout the season, man? Uh, My mama keep me motivated for real. Most yeah. definitely. Yeah. Like, what, what type of, she give you pep talks? What, 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 the, what she say? Yeah, like, she give me pep talks. She made me keep my head up. Like, when I was, like, little, I used to cry after every game. Every game, because I used to hate losing. Mom always told me, like, you know, keep your head up. Like, we always have another game. Like, facts. work harder next time. Like, fix your mistakes and stuff like that. So I take that to heart. Like, well, my mama tell me she's doing me be humble. I stay humble. Like, yeah. Definitely. I to listen to mom Dukes, man. It's good. You got that support. So, we're saying that, um, what would people be surprised to learn about you off the field? That I'm a, I'm a real, hey, I'm chill, funny, and like, I'm fun to be around. Like, you know, I can get along with anybody. Like, Right. That's good. That's good, man. 
question. What values or lessons did you learn from football that you carry with you off the field and in, into life? Uh, oh, bro, like the brotherhood, like how like helping your brother on the field, like or my like if my teammate kept like we thought like tackle right, I just tackle, tackle overall. Yeah, overall. So, like if my teammate. Catches the ball. I'm not gonna be like, oh, I'm I'm not about to help him because he got the ball and I want the ball. No, I'm not no selfish kid. Right. So I'm gonna go help him. Like I'm gonna block for him and stuff like that. And like, you know, it's right. like brotherhood. Like, it's these my brother inside of school and outside of school. It's like you know, the bond still will ever will always be the off and on the field. Right. Yeah. All right. That's it, brother.